Welcome to the Avid Nexus Cloud Spaces Getting Started tutorial. If you're a new Nexus customer, this is how you would go about getting Cloud Spaces. You need to come to the activate and download your product page and enter the hardware serial number that comes with your Nexus purchase and click activate. After your product is registered, you will be brought to a plan selection page. However, if you are an existing Nexus customer and have already registered your Nexus on Avid account, just go to your Avid account homepage and click on My Products and Subscription. Under the Avid Nexus Pro tab, you will see your registered product along with the Add Cloud Spaces button. Currently, Cloud Spaces is only available to Nexus software version 2019.4 and above. Once you click on the Add Cloud Spaces button, it will take you to the plan selection page. The next steps are to select a region where you would like to deploy your Cloud Spaces. So I'm going to select East US and I'm going to select a plan, 10 terabyte plan. I'll accept the terms and conditions, then I'll click Next. I will now be asked to enter my credit card information, which is what we need to collect any overages on top of the annual subscription cost. After you successfully enter your credit card information, your subscription will be created and you will be redirected to your MyAvid account. Wait for an email to appear, which will have the next set of instructions on how you would go about activating your Cloud Spaces. Next, what we need to do is go to the Avid On Demand portal. In the Avid On Demand portal, this is your Cloud Spaces account. So you need to go to your About page. In the About page, you'll see the plan that you had deployed along with the system ID and the Cloud Spaces activation file. Download the activation file. Save it. Now log into your Avid Nexus Management Console and you can see that there's a cloud options. Click on cloud, then click on activate Avid Nexus. On this page, you need to enter the system ID and the activation file that you can find on your about page. So enter the system ID and upload the activation file that you just downloaded. Once you do that, just click on activate. Click on OK. You can now see that your Avid Nexus Cloud Spaces was activated. By looking at the subscription status, it says active and your included storage is 10 terabytes. What will happen is now a new storage group will be created for you, which is called the Cloud Spaces. And you can go about creating workspaces in this new storage group. So let's create a workspace. So the storage group is Cloud Spaces, and this is going to be our Cloud Workspace. You can set how much capacity you want to give. You Remember, you have a total of 10 terabytes, but you can set your workspaces as per your requirement. Select Users, Save. Okay, so now you have a new workspace, which is the Cloud Workspace. So now if you go to your Nexus Client Manager, you can see that the new workspace that you created, Cloud Workspace, is here. Go ahead and mount it. You can also mount, I'm also going to mount an existing workspace. Then I can just go about transferring media from one workspace to the other by simply copying it. This is my Cloud Workspace. So now my file is successfully moved into the workspace in the cloud. So now if you go back to your Nexus management console, you can see that you have already started using some of the space that you had allocated in your workspace. And that is it. And that's how you quickly get started with cloud spaces. Thank you.